Staff here at Bosphorus Turkish Cuisine and Dr. Phillips are raving about their new team member. Never complains, never comes in, hungover, late, he's always on time, and he doesn't talk back, which is really an advantage, you know, so. <laughs> Probably because the new employee, Bo, is a robot. Running food in this newly renovated restaurant that's about doubled in size. General Manager Mickey Lee says it gets packed with hungry patrons at times, especially weekends. He saves us a lot of trips. Um, he's not replacing any existing employees. He's an add-on to our employees. Bo is a survey robot created by Bear Robotics, the company partnering with Pepsi to lease the helping hand to restaurants around the world. One of our field operators come in, they're going to talk with the team, they're going to discuss workflow questions, and then they'll start mapping the restaurant out. The robot reports to the kitchen, where the cook loads the tiers with plates of food. With the press of a few buttons, the robot is assigned a table to serve, and he's off, playing a song or chime on the way to the hungry customers. Oh, hoş geldiniz. Awesome. for us. Thank you. You're very welcome. So the robot has three cameras built into it and it also has LIDAR, so if anything comes into its path last second, it will stop on a dime and it will find its next best route around that obstacle to get to its final destination. So it's extremely safe. Each tier has sensors, so when the plates are removed, he knows the task is complete and returns to the kitchen for another run. He's very productive um, and he's going, 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 like we only have to charge him once a day. It's hard working. So what's the going rate for this robotic food runner? Typically it breaks down to about $2.75 an hour. That's based on 12-hour work days. The bots are released to restaurants and businesses around the world, about a thousand currently working across the U.S. I don't think it will ever replace the humans, but I think it's a great enhancement to the humans. Just like in any industry, I mean, when you're looking you know, at productivity and things of that nature, a restaurant is no different. You know, we will always be the ones making the food it saves us time, saves us money, makes us be more successful. You're always going to want, I think one of the reasons that people go out to restaurants is because they want to be entertained too, you know, to a certain extent, they want to have that experience. Bo is entertaining though, so I think if it's kind of a combination of humans and robots, I think it will be a very successful one. A potential sign of what's to come in the future. You may have noticed the Servi robot at a few other restaurants in Florida, especially around Central Florida. Some have been using it on a trial basis. The company says it's been a useful tool lately to help with staffing shortages that some restaurants are facing right now. You can learn more about Bo and the Servi robots on clickorlando.com slash insider.